Paul, that's a bitterly disappointing defeat. Eight points up, ten minutes to go, and uh, we come away with a, a defeat. Yeah, we do, and it's just really, really hard to take. I thought, let's say, eight, eight points up with eight, well, as many minutes really, and talked about seeing the game out, kicking the ball at the corners, and, and keeping trapping them in. But we didn't. We had a scrum uh, where we tried to score off, off player one, ended up in touch on player one or two, and then we put shift play on a yardage and. Uh, Scorched down the touch line and ended up in touch on play two, giving some field position, which led to a nothing kick, which come off uh, Ryan Johnson's boot into the arms of their player who, who managed to score in the corner on the death with 45 seconds to go. So, pretty much heartbreaking stuff. Can't fault the lads' effort, I think, you know, but again, decision making, seeing the game out, uh, game management with eight minutes to go was real, real poor. We had three, t three chances to take control of the game and see it out and we didn't, you know, we, we look as though we want to score on every player, keep saying it week on, week out and, and it's costing us that we, we want to add more points, we don't want to have to, still have to score more than eight points, we just keep going, see the, and, and turn turn the screw and keep them in the corners and that game was won and uh, I think we got penalised for diving through the ruck when there was no dummy half there, we had, uh, and they penalised Jerry Stack, which I don't know what he's supposed to do, uh, if he goes through the ruck when there's no dummy half in the player. He just played it and he just went to jump on the ball, we penalised for that and even in the dying seconds under the post um, we had we had a chance there of a penalty and it, it was called six again so you know but you know when you when you're where we are at the moment we've been there before that, that, that you put a lot of pressure on yourselves there's no pressure on me on the fellas I'll take all the pressure but you know I can just see that we're just a little bit tight in what we do and you know we think we've got to win by 20 when we got we can only win, we, we only need to win by eight. So it's disappointing. There'll be a lot of outside noise at the moment about us, probably as I speak. Uh, well, we've just got to keep everything in house and, and keep fighting because, like I say, the effort from the lads is not questionable. It's just how we manage things and how we see games out when, when we're winning. And we did that last year. We've seen games out, kicked into the corners, we were disciplined. Today we, we had them trapped and uh, we were just slightly offside rather than slightly onside. All the little things you know, that leads to a little bit of trouble and, and the rook speed for them, we didn't do really that well. But it was a better performance in the last two games, but we're playing a different team to that. A, a very much a team that's together. I thought Swinton were buoyant, you know, Alan's gotten buoyant and playing for each other, a bit like us, playing with momentum from when they went up. So we've just got to get it right as a group, manage the games a little bit more and see games out when we get in that position, because if we don't, we'll end up on the losing side.